if we talk about advancement in surgical technology, um, I think two big parts have happened which have affected many things in our uh, delivery of, of, of care. Um, one would be in the medical diagnostics and two would be in surgical instrumentation. In medical diagnostics, we have improved in terms of the ability or the use of different types of um, techniques such as uh, ultrasonography as well as um, manometry and what we consider functional studies where we look at how a person's body actually functions in its natural state. Um, uh, and that has helped us understand the pathologies better. For example, in the past, if you told me that uh, you had a constipation, um, the only thing we could do were x-rays. Now, an x-ray is a static film. It just tells us what's happening at that one point in time. But what we can do today would be things like uh, functional ultrasounds, where we get a person to try to strain down as if they're having a bowel movement, and we can look at how the organs move while that is happening. We can have a continuous video process of it to help us understand how that person is affected by his problems. It also therefore helps us understand the actual uh, uh, process of, for example, for defecation. We now understand it better, and in over the last 20 years or so, that development not just in ultrasound, but all the other medical diagnostics have helped us understand how our pelvic floor works better. The other thing is instrumentation. Uh, we, as equipment gets smaller, thinner, but sturdier, and yet more flexible, it allows us many more options and variations with our technique in surgery. That has driven um, the process of and progress of laparoscopic surgery or keyhole surgery today, um, where now we will consider laparoscopic, be it keyhole or minimal access surgery, as the gold standard uh, when it comes to surgery within the abdomen. Why? Because it, we can do everything that the old uh, conventional open surgery could do, yet we reduced the patient's suffering, we reduced the recovery time, we reduced complications, we got everybody back faster to their daily lifestyle. We got their quality of life back to where they were with hardly any deficits, if at all, to do.